Those of you who have seen this channel before might not recognize a video like this because you're used to me making knives or restoring knives. But this one, I'm going to be showing you how to sharpen knives. I'll be using this chef's knife for an example. So as you can see, we're going to be starting out with the 400 grit. It's been soaking in water for like 10 minutes. I just took it out. I just sprinkled some water on it and go at about a 15 degree angle, depending on the knife. This one will be 15 degree angle. Hunting knives might be closer to 45. And just go back and forth until you get a decent edge on it with the 400 grit at least. Now I'll be switching to the 1000 grit because the 400 grit does not get the knife very sharp. But now with the 1000 grit, sprinkle some water. Now I'll be moving on to the 3000 grit stone right here. I'll do the same thing, sprinkle some water on top in the same 15 degree angle and repeat the process. Now I'll be moving up to the 8000 grit. This is for those super fine edges and will not be that much sharper than the 3000 but it will make that slight little difference if you need it. Again, keeping that 15 degree angle for this knife. By this point, the knife should be very sharp. Now this knife is very sharp. I'll be sharpening a few more knives, and then I'll show you how sharp these are with some tests. This is the next knife. It's a very similar process, but this one's bevel might be closer to 20 degrees. Thousand grit. Eight thousand. Now this knife too is very sharp. For washing these knives, I recommend grabbing the knife, going on the back side wiping up so it does not cut the sponge in half. Go around, back up, just carefully right there. I'll be testing out the sharpness of this knife against a banana and a cucumber. First I'm going to get the banana and just no pressure, completely chop it. Just to see there's no pressure, holding it from the back. Now it's time for the cucumber. Absolutely just slicing right through it. This is no pressure. Clean. 